This box is called the Amped Quest Chest. What is that? Well, it's a goal of mine to get this wooden chest filled with electronic treasures to travel all of Ampgard. Look at all the lights. This thing is so exciting. So how does it work? Well, it's pretty simple, really. You take it to your park day or to an event, and in an open outside area with clear access to the sky, you open it up and flip the power switch on the left side. Make sure to keep it open so that the antennas can get a very good signal. There are four lights, a white light to tell you there's power, a yellow light for battery status, a blue light for cellular reception, and a green light to tell you that the GPS location has been found and sent over the network to the AmpQuest server. When a location has been tagged, the AmpQuest server looks for an AmpGuard park nearby, and if there is one, it automatically tags the park as being visited. You can see some test data here imagining the chest has traveled to a few parks in the Principality of the Nine Blades and the Kingdom of Golden Vale. But what if you use the AmpQuest chest at an event and it's nowhere near a park? Well, you'll see this show up as an unknown event. All you have to do is log in using your Facebook ID, and then you can edit the event and shortly describe it. In this case, we've used the chest at Great Eastern 2017 and simply have to update the tag accordingly. If you've tagged a park or event, please visit the Facebook page as shown here and post a picture or two of the people at your park or the event holding up the chest. It would be so great to see all your wonderful faces with that chest. The chest needs to travel, so it needs guardians, and I really want you to be one. If someone gives you the chest to take to another location, please claim the guardianship on the guardians page with your Facebook ID. Then we can know who had it in the past and who has it right now. The AmpQuest website has a couple of great features beside the AmpQuest tags. You can use it to look up parks by name. In this case, we'll look up Linagond. The info about the park includes the link, if there's one provided in the ORC information, and then the link to the ORC page itself. You can also use it to find a city and locate the parks around that area. In this case, let's type in Anchorage. Let's zoom out and we'll see if there's any parks around Anchorage. Hey, there's three. Let's look at the information for them. What happens when the chest is on? The yellow light continues to flash. Well, it has to be recharged. Carefully take the USB cable out from the little clips. Plug it into a USB power source and make sure you turn on the power switch on the left side. That's really important, otherwise the battery isn't gonna get charged. When the yellow light goes solid yellow, the battery's charged. So turn off the power switch, unplug the USB cable and carefully clip the cable back into the case. The battery is actually pretty large, so I don't expect it'll need to be charged very often because you're just going to tag a location and then turn it off. I hope you'll help the AmpQuest chest travel to all the places in AmpGuard that I, Kismet of Felfrost, might not get to.